And now for the Net 10 Wireless Halftime Show. And we're back here in Jacksonville's Veterans Memorial Arena for the Net 10 Wireless Halftime Show. Hi, everybody. I'm James Bates. You know, we're basically here in Veterans Memorial Arena in the parking lot of Everbank Stadium, where the Jacksonville Jaguars play their home games on Sundays in the fall. But this ain't no outdoor football here. Uh-uh. See, I can talk like that because it's redneck night here in Jacksonville. But it ain't no outdoor game. And I mean it. There's no punting, of course, in arena football. And to stay on the special teams tip, there's no onside kicks that aren't fun. Right? I mean, like <laughs> 21 onside kick attempts for Orlando this year. That's a lot more than the outdoor game. But when you look at it, Ant, when a team is scoring like Spokane, the leaders in the league, almost 70 points a game, if they're going to score, you might as well try to get it back, right? You referenced how fun it is. It's one of the craziest aspects of the AFL game because you see teams attempting onside kicks at a variety of different times and there's multiple outcomes that can lead to a positive result for the team attempting the onside kick. It's not just about if you recover the football, but you get to defend the short field if the other team recovers it and you could still end up even if you give up a score, the drive comes to a head much more quickly. But let's take a look at a couple of different ways you attempt an onside. More traditionally, you'll see teams attempt the high hop. So the ball gets spotted at the goal line. And as the coverage team, those seven angry men cross the goal line. They've got to make sure they stay on side. But the ball has to cross the 10 yard line to have an opportunity to field it there. The team kicks the football out of bounds. So not an attempt or a, a possibility there to recover it. Now we see the dribbler to the short side of the field. In this situation, gunners take out the blockers up front. Now your ball guy in this situation from Philadelphia has the opportunity because they've done a great job clearing out space for he recovers the football, so will get the recovery. And so just so you know the rules, the boards, of course, are live. The walls in arena football on a play from scrimmage, but on an onside kick, whether it's 10 yards or not, it kills the ball. But remember, those nets and the bars are always live and always interesting. Now you know. We'll be right back with more Net 10 Wireless Halftime Show.